Hey, Gsauce, Geobop here. Speed is an interesting concept. It comes in many forms, such as running, pacing, jogging, crawling, skipping, galloping, sprinting, tiptoeing, and my personal favorite, walking. So now, let's get more into the main topic of this video. Subway Surfers! It's the game that everyone has had on their mobile device at some point in their lives, whether it was on your iPad in 2014, or your grandma's phone currently, because you got really bored and you had your grandma's phone for some reason. This game contains an amazingly compelling plot. So, the main character of this game, the mad lad, the absolute Chad, but his name's not actually Chad, Jake, runs through railroad tracks and just f***ing dies. <coughs> but that's not what we're talking about today, you see, that all, all that was just filler. We're answering the age-old question, how fast is Jake from Subway Surfers? Let's start off with some measurements and we're gonna be measuring his speed without any power-ups like the jetpack or wh what other power-ups are there in subway surfers as those are unrealistic to real life and running into trains and not exploding into a million pieces of flesh isn't unrealistic hey maybe he has strong skin okay shut up to get his speed what we're gonna need is distance and the amount of time he ran that distance because the speed formula is speed equals distance over time. So the game speeds up as you get farther, but according to a Stack Exchange forum, at around 500 to 600,000 points, it reaches the maximum speed. So I found a clip that is way beyond that amount of points and analyzed its frames. The video runs at 20 frames per second, and it took Jake five frames to pass a single subway car because 5 divided by 20 is 1 quarter, that means if I convert it into seconds, he took a quarter of a second, or 0 0.25 seconds, to pass a single subway car. If a New York City R142A subway car is 15.65 meters, or 51.33 feet long, then that means Jake would be running 15.65 meters per 0 0.25 seconds. To convert this to meters per second, we must multiply both numbers by 4. Therefore, the man, the myth, the legend, Jake from Subway Surfers, top speed is... 62.6 meters per second, or 255.36 kilometers per hour, or 140 miles per hour. Wow! In comparison, subway trains are designed to go up to 70 miles per hour, or 112 kilometers per hour, which is less than half of this boy's running speed. But none of this really matters, because the policeman's little dog can also run that fast. Instead of visualizing Jake's speed with a person running really fast, I'm going to show a dog going really fast. Okay, so the moral of the story is don't run through a subway system or you will... <coughs>